Hello and welcome to another episode of Christmas with Indie Brands. Today it is Christmas with Makeup by Lisa. I have swatched out all of the single shadows, pigments, multi-chromes I have of, uh, from Makeup by Lisa. So let me just show you this on first. So firstly, we have this pigment here, this loose pigment, is a holographic this pigment called Zanies. This is new, how beautiful is that? And then next we have this one here is Temptation. And that is a really beautiful multi-chrome. Look at all the shifts in that. And the next one along here, this one is Pandemonium. This one is like flakes, um, is the only way I can describe it. So you basically gently, what I did, I sprayed my brush with um, setting spray to pick up a few flakes and then you kind of dab them on and look at that shift. That is so beautiful. And then next we have Sea Spray. So this one here. And Sea Spray is a loose pigment. Really, really pretty sparkly loose pigment. And then we have Fusion, which you've probably seen already because Fusion is one I already had. And uh, look at that shift. Another beautiful multi-chrome. And then next is Blue Lagoon, which you may also have seen. Um, Blue Lagoon I had already. Um, I will let you know afterwards which ones were gifted and which ones I bought myself. Um, but some of these were very kindly gifted. Um, there was This video is not sponsored um, at all. There was no expectation for me to make a video on these. Um, I just thought they fitted in really well with the Christmas with Indie Brands. Um, I really wanted to. I really, so far, I've enjoyed pretty much everything I've tried from the brand. Um, so where was I? So yeah, Blue Lagoon um, is the last of the multi-chrome pigments. And then next, these are the singles I have, the pressed shadows. We have this one here, which is Charisma. It's got a really beautiful kind of purpley brown shift, purple to brown, absolutely gorgeous. And then we have Sea Spray, which is this really beautiful blue here. And that look at that, absolutely gorgeous. And then last on this arm, we have Aurora. I don't know if you can see, it's a blue and it's got like green and pink shifts in it. Absolutely stunning. And then on to the other arm. So I have here, the first one we have here is Cobwebs. These, all of these are newer, newer pressed shadows. Um, so yeah, this Cobwebs, which is a really nice gum metal. And then next is Cindy. So Cindy is this really beautiful purpley pink. And next we have, next one along is Mocha. That is absolutely stunning. Look at the shine on that, really metallic. And then we have Harvest Moon. Again, another absolutely stunning metallic shimmer. And then next is Ginger Beer. So this one here is Ginger Beer. I really love the tone of that one. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, next up after Ginger Beer, this is Mango. Absolutely stunning kind of, well, mango color. <laughs> It's gorgeous. And then next up we have the reformulated Spellbound. Um, you probably have seen the original Spellbound um, that I showed in a previous video, um, but it's been reformulated. And this is the reformulated Spellbound. Um, absolutely stunning. So much more pigment to it and more depth. I really like that. Um, next up we have Infinity, which is this really beautiful, kind of iridescent shimmer that shifts blue, purple, pink. Oh, it's stunning. And then next we have 
this one here which is green tea and green tea is I'd say one of my favorites look at that green it's a beautiful tone I really really can't wait to try that one and then lastly we have blueberry and um, blueberry is this really beautiful shimmery is it purple it's like a couple of tones of purple it's absolutely gorgeous so yeah that is all of the swatches so I'm going to get these swatches off and then we will get on into the look okay so let's get on into the look it is going to be an all shimmer look a really sparkly fairy type look that's what I'm aiming for um so yes I have primed my eye eye eyes <laughs> with the ABH um, eye primer so the first shade I'm going into is sea spray the pressed sea spray which is the blue and I'm going to be just putting that through the crease anyone who says you can't put shimmers in the crease well I do I think they can look really nice so makeup by Lisa is a new brand um, out this year based on the sunny Isle of Wight which is right at the bottom of the UK and is where I come from which does make it a bit more exciting for me so Lisa is a professional makeup artist and she has worked at events such as the exclusive London fashion show the big reunion tour and the Isle of Wight's festival and if you don't know what the best of was it was just an amazing festival loads of bands just really wonderful it's no longer um on the isle of wight but it used to be a yearly festival that was uh, a really exciting one one my daughter used to love going to my my sister used to take her every year and she loved it anyways we're getting off track here <laughs> so uh so yeah, Lisa's a professional makeup artist and uh, she's done many weddings and she decided to dip into the realm of making her own products and starting up her own line, which so far I have to say I have been extremely impressed with. Um, this is the first time possibly trying all of these shades on my eyes that I'm going to use. Um, I will let you know. <laughs> But yeah, she so she started up and she's very, very new. She runs masterclasses um, on how to do a range of looks um, that is on the Isle of Wight. So you can book there to do that, which is wonderful. Look at this colour. Oh, this is so pretty. so pretty considering this is a shimmer going on dry look at the shine in that absolutely gorgeous I will link uh, makeup by Lisa's website in the description box below so that if you want you can go and uh, check out the products I also do have a code which will save you 20% if you use it. So that will be listed also in the description box below. It's not affiliated. I don't gain anything from it, but you get a discount, which uh, I think is a very good one. So uh, yeah, if you uh, fancy having a look, the discount is in the description box below. Right, so next up, I'm just using the same brush which is actually a brush from Moda what's it called I think it's small eyeshader I haven't got my glasses on so um, we're going into Aurora to blend that out oh my gosh look at that we are definitely going all shine today wow I think this is the first time I've done an all shimmer look on my channel. Look at that. 
Oh, stunning. So Makeup by Lisa has a range of eyeshadows, a range of multi-chromes, duochromes, um, pressed shadows. Um, she also does liquid lipsticks, bullet lipsticks, lip glosses, false lashes um, and highlighters. I think I've covered all of it there. If I haven't, then I'm sorry. <laughs> but there's, there's quite a bit on there. She's uh, really gone for it and she's always improving the quality. Oh my God, that is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. I am going to have to go back in with a bit of sea spray to bring the, uh, the more blue back <laughs> in the crease. Oh, look at that. Really going for snow fairy vibes here. Absolutely gorgeous. I'm just going to nip off, stick on some NYX glitter primer and then we will carry on with the eyes. Okay, so I've got the glitter primer on. So I'm just going to use the same brush that I used to put on the glitter primer, which is a flat brush from Makeup by Tammy Cosmetics. Um, so I'm just going to dip into that. And I'm just going to be placing Zanies. Oh my word. Oh, look at that. Oh, that screams fairy. Christmas fairy. So I'm just patting it over. The primer so that hopefully we don't get too much fallout. I'm not quite so worried because uh, we are going for a really Christmas look. Oh look at that. Oh I cannot tell you how much I am loving this. Oh crikey Lisa if you're watching this I am in love with this loose pigment, completely in love, I just want to bathe in it. So on the lower lash line I'm going to first go into with a little Morphe brush, um, Aurora, which is the lighter of the two and just want this on the inner part, oh look at that. Wow. This is not primed as well. I haven't primed under my eyes. Wow. Just going on dry. Wow. How stunning is that? And next we are going into Aurora. For the outer edge of the lower lash line. Wow. I'm loving where this is headed. Wow. I cannot get over how sparkly and fairy-like, snow fairy, <laughs> my eyes are looking. I am loving this. I'm, I'm rambling. Right. <laughs> where was I at? Okay, so let's get a little brush. I am absolutely living for this look. Wow. So for the inner corner highlight, I'm going to go in with Infinity, um, which is that really nice iridescent. Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. Lisa, this new formula is banging. That hint of purple next to that green, that looks so beautiful. I am absolutely loving this look. Now this is Christmassy. Definitely Snow Fairy vibes. Definitely. Should we put a bit of that under the brow bone as well? 
just use that as a brow bone highlight. Why not? Oh, wow. Oh, I love that. I'm so happy I decided to do this uh, Christmas with Indie Brands series because it's it's given me a chance to really showcase different products from the brands and they're, they're brands that I know and love and definitely would recommend. So, wow. Right, eyeshadow bits done. I am thinking... I have these little stars. I don't know how well you can see. These little stars, they came in the packaging. But I want, <laughs> I want to use them to do some decorating. So I'm just going to head off camera to pretty much finish my face and I will come back to do the highlight with you. So don't go anywhere. So I'm back, I have finished the eyes, I stuck some of those stars on, as you can see I just stuck on with eyelash glue. Um, the mascara I have is Barium That's How I Roll, black eyeliner is just e.l.f. liquid liner. Um, over the black liner I have put the Collection Glam Crystals Dazzling Gel Liner in Cosmic Stars. And in my waterline I have used the Essence Long Lasting Eye Pencil into two turquoise. Now the eyelashes are from Makeup by Lisa in the style Pixie. I thought Pixie was the perfect choice for a snow fairy look. And on my lips I have the liquid lipstick in the shade Coco from Makeup by Lisa. This was very kindly gifted to me. And over top of that I've patted some of the holographic loose pigment zanies just to give it that real sparkle. And finally, we're just going to go in with some highlight. And the highlighter I'm going to use is from Makeup by Lisa. And it is in the shade Pearl. I think this highlighter is going to go perfectly with this look. Let's have a look here. Look, it's got blue and, uh, blue and purple kind of highlights. Yes, that's it. We are going to go a little bit ham today because I really want that fairy glow look at that that is it yes absolutely perfect so a little bit there and a little bit on the end of the nose I'm living for this look. I feel like a Christmas snow fairy and I am not mad at that. I love it. So that's it for Christmas with Makeup by Lisa. Let me know what you think of this look in the comments section below and uh, there will be more episodes coming of Christmas with Indie Brands. I do have at least one more coming, possibly another couple. We'll see. Um, I've really, really enjoyed this. I have loved the look I've created and I am so impressed with everything. Absolutely everything. I love it. So Lisa, well done on these. I am super impressed. And uh, yeah, so thank you so much for joining me today. If you've liked this video, please give it a thumbs up, hit the like button. It really helps me out. And if you're not subscribed already, then I hope you'll consider sticking around. I am a lover of all, all things makeup, really, um, but mainly colourful and indie brands. So if that sounds like something that you like, then hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you don't miss the next time I upload. Thank you again for joining me today. I hope you're all having a great day, great evening and taking care of yourselves. So I will see you again very, very soon. Goodbye.